They ruled the Earth for over 150 million years. From the towering Tyrannosaurus Rex to the swift-footed Velociraptor, dinosaurs dominated every corner of the prehistoric world. But deep beneath the surface something was changing, the climate was shifting, seas were rising, and ecosystems were collapsing. This is the story of their struggle, a desperate fight for survival as Earth itself turned against them. Asterisk, during the Mesozoic era, the age of dinosaurs, life flourished in ways never seen before. The Jurassic and Cretaceous periods saw the rise of some of the most iconic creatures to ever walk the Earth, Herbivores like Triceratops and Brachiosaurus roamed vast, fern-covered plains. Carnivores like Allosaurus and Gigantosaurus hunted with. Precision and power dot the continents were positioned differently. Warm temperatures and high oxygen levels made it a paradise for reptilian giants. Life was thriving. But nature is never static, asterisk scientists believe that around 80 million years ago, the Earth began a slow transformation. Plate tectonics shifted the land masses, creating new mountain ranges and altering ocean currents. Rainfall patterns changed. Seasonal extremes became more common. Volcanic activity in regions like present day India released vast amounts of carbon dioxide and sulfur dioxide into the atmosphere. These changes seemed minor at first, but their impact on the fragile ecosystem was enormous. Forests began to shrink, swamps dried up and food sources began to vanish. Asterisk herbivores were the first to suffer. With less vegetation, massive species like Ankylosaurus and Hadrosaurus had to travel longer distances in search of food. Many starved, carnivores too were in trouble. With fewer herbivores to hunt, they became desperate, even cannibalistic. Fossils show signs of injuries and violent clashes, even among the same species. Meanwhile, smaller dinosaurs like the Truden began adapting. With sharper senses and larger brains, they evolved to cope. But for many of the larger species, it was a race against time, asterisk around 66 million years ago. The Deccan traps in India erupted, not once, but over thousands of years, these massive lava flows released deadly gases, covering the skies in ash and darkening the planet. Photosynthesis slowed. Plants began to die en masse. The food chain started to collapse from the bottom up dop acid rain poisoned the water global temperatures dropped rapidly dinosaurs already weakened by years of struggle now faced a climate crisis of apocalyptic proportions asterisk but the worst was yet to come 66 million years ago a six mile wide asteroid slammed into what is now the yucatan peninsula in mexico the Impact released energy equivalent to 10 billion atomic bombs. Tsunamis raced across the oceans. Forests were flattened. Wildfires ignited globally. But the real devastation came from the skies. Dust, soot, and vaporized rock blocked the sun, triggering a nuclear winter effect. Temperatures plummeted. Plants died. Herbivores followed. And finally, the great carnivores fell, asterisk within. Just a few months, over 75% of all life on Earth was gone. Entire species vanished from the fossil record. Dinosaurs, once the rulers of the Earth, were no more, only a few species. Mostly small and warm-blooded creatures like early mammals and some feathered dinosaurs survived the aftermath. They would inherit the Earth, asterisk, but did dinosaurs really go extinct? Not entirely. Birds, as we now know, are the direct descendants of small. Feathered the ROPODS dot. Every time you see a hawk soaring or a pigeon pecking at crumbs, you're looking at a living dinosaur. Their story didn't end. It evolved. The age of giants ended, but their legacy continues in the sky, in our science, and in our imagination. The fall of the dinosaurs wasn't just an end. It was a lesson that nature is powerful. That no creature, no matter how dominant, is immune to change and that survival belongs not to the strongest, but to the most adaptable. This was the story of the dinosaur's final chapter. A reminder of Earth's ever-changing balance.